For this week's top um, video, I would like to share with you Prime Climb, and it's basically a math game that uses all four properties of math. Now, this game has, is a board. The board, unfortunately, does not fit right here right now, so I'm just going to show you this half of it. So the goal of the game is to start from zero, go all the way through the numbers to get to number 101, which is a prime number, hence Prime Climb. Anyway, so every player has two pieces, and their goal is to get from the number zero all the way to 101. So you start by rolling both dice, and you see, oh, I have eight. Do I want to do eight times zero? Well, eight times zero leaves me on zero, so it doesn't really pay. Eight minus zero doesn't help. However, I can do eight plus zero, and then I will jump to the number eight. And so the, the key is to just, you know, um, work sorry eight plus zero work through the properties and figure out your way around the board now here's where it gets tricky one might think let's for the first half start with addition the second half go with uh, mul you know, multiplication division and alter alternate between the two but here's where you can actually change um the way it moves let's just say this player orange is on four and i were to roll a two so now i'm here well let's say i'm on one so if i'm on one i might do one plus two um get to three, and then three plus one, knock the player off. And now the player, and can you imagine if the player is on number 96? Well then in that case, the player's got to start all the way from zero. So in this one, I was able to use addition, but there are times where you might need to use subtraction to knock a player off playing offensively, defensively, and just you know to create a strategy. Now there are some additional, in addition to the math, there are some prime numbers. There's 41 over here. There is number 67 right here, 61. There's a whole bunch of prime numbers. The prime numbers, as you can tell from you know from what I've been showing you, are the numbers that are in red. So prime numbers are numbers that cannot be divided uh, by anything but itself. So when you get a number like that, here's where the game you know changes into more of a family type of game where they have these adorable cards. You turn it over and let's say keeper, send all pawns without two spaces of. Uh, within two spaces of you back to start. So this would be really beneficial if this player was over here. Well, now I get to play it. I can choose to play it now. I could choose to play it later. If I'm getting close to 101 and I see another player, let's say I'm at 97 and there's a player at 95, well, that player is my competition right now. So I might choose to send them all the way back to start and to help me win the game. So overall, using basic properties of addition, multiplication, subtraction, division, and, you know, with a twist of prime numbers, you know, you could really have a fun family game night. Um, you know, these cards add great twists. These pegs, you have two of them. So you, even though you're just playing by yourself, you really um, have to focus on two aspects of the board and the dice because they are ten-sided gives you a whole other aspect of the gameplay. So this game is a lot of fun. Um, if you do have a beginner child who's learning addition, just, you know what, take one die and start with eight. Eight plus one is nine. And just keep rolling. And, you know, they could work on their math facts and getting faster at math. You could do the same thing for multiplication once they start. Um, we actually, right now, I used it in my second grade classroom like this. Oh, the kids see one and a two. They could choose to do the number 12. They could choose to do the number 21. So at first, you're using single digits with double digits. But as they get, let's say, what is 64 plus 21? One, then they really have to start using their you know mathematical knowledge so overall this is a great game to play for adults this is a really fun game you know to play with kids these cards are a great twist and prime climb is just one of those games that are fun both for the classroom and family game night this is a game that we do enjoy immensely